Alicia Weber, a licensed massage therapist at Alive and Well in Mineola, Florida. And I'm gonna answer a question that I get asked a lot. Did you become a massage therapist first or a strength feat performer? As you know, I'm the world's most prolific female record holder in the world and I have been since 2012. The answer is, I was a very serious runner first and competing on the national level. And in July 4th, 1996, when I was 16 years old, I placed sixth overall in a 5K that was the most competitive in Southwestern Pennsylvania against professional women. And I ran an 18 minute, 29 second. After that, I came home and went to a party that we had at the house. And an uncle saw me flexed, chiseled in a tank top after this race that I was so happy about, placing so well in. And he said to me, you need to become a massage therapist. And he had chronic back pain and he leaped onto the pavement and asked for a massage. I didn't even know much about massage, so I just joked around and did like these karate chops on him and he was serious. Everybody started laughing and he said, no, I'm serious. You would do really good in massage. And at that point, that's when I started thinking about it. I was a strength feet performer starting back in middle school when I created my own routines and performed on apparatuses. So I was a strength feet performer way before I became a massage therapist.